Hi, welcome to this example on finding equations of lines. What we've got to do is find the equation of a line parallel to the line 3y minus 2x minus 6 equals 0 and passing through the point minus 1 minus 2. Now if I was doing a coordinate geometry question like this I would generally draw a diagram. I'd have my axes x and y and I'd mark on my point minus 1 minus 2 which would be to the left one unit two down somewhere down here minus 1 minus 2. Now we're looking for a line passing through this point but parallel to this line. The only problem is I don't know what this line looks like. I don't know whether it looks like this or like this. So first of all I want to be able to sketch this line on here. And one way I could do it is to write it in the form y equals mx plus c. Because when it's in this format, I can see which way it slopes and also where it crosses the y-axis, given by the number or constant c. So let's start by taking our line 3y minus 2x minus 6 equals 0. And to get it into this format, I need to first of all add 2x and 6 to both sides to give me 3y equals 2x plus 6. Now I'm going to get rid of that 3 by dividing both sides by 3 and I get y equals 2 thirds x plus 6 divided by 3 which is 2. So I can clearly see now that this line has a gradient of 2 thirds and when x is naught, y is 2, which will tell me that it crosses the y-axis at 2 units up. Let's say that's the point where y is 2. So a gradient of 2 thirds is going to be a line coming through the 2, something like that, a positive gradient. So what I'm looking for now is a line passing through minus 1, 2, which is parallel. So that line's going to look something like that. So how do I get this line? Well, I've got its gradient because it's parallel now. The gradient is 2 thirds. The m value, if you like, is 2 thirds. So if that's the case, I might as well use y minus y1 equals m bracket x minus x1 as the form of the equation of this line. Because I've got m, x1, y1 is just a point on the line and I've got that point here. It's minus 1, minus 2. So I'm in a position to get the equation of that line. So let's just write an intro here. Therefore the equation of the line say the parallel line of the parallel line okay is what is it going to be what is going to be y minus y1 being the minus 2 equals m being the two thirds bracket x minus x1 x1 is the minus 1 so that's essentially the equation of the line Depending on the question, I would write it in certain formats. Suppose we're going for y equals mx plus c format. I'd most probably want to multiply by 3, and I would times both sides by 3 and get 3y here. This is plus 2, so we end up with plus 6 equals, and if I times this side by 3, the 3 will cancel and just leave me with 2 times x plus 1, which would give me 2x plus 2. So if I was to subtract 6 from both sides, I'd have 3y equals 2x minus 4. And then finally, to get the equation of the line, we would therefore have y equals, if I divide both sides by 3, 2 thirds x minus 4 thirds. And you can see it's got the same gradient, 2 thirds, and where it crosses the y-axis when x is naught is at 
minus four thirds. And okay, it's not accurately drawn, but it's not too bad. It gives us an idea that it looks reasonable. Okay, well I hope that's given you an idea then how to do examples like this one. And that brings us now to the end of this particular example.